dragons and men riding thereon, and coming on the winds from the east and from the west to the south. And the noise of their wagons was heard. And when this turmoil took place, the holy ones from heaven remarked it. And the pillars of the earth were moved from their place. And the sound thereof was heard from one end of heaven to the other in one day. And they shall all fall down and worship the Lord of spirits. And this is the end of the second parable. And I began to speak the third parable concerning the righteous and elect. Blessed are ye, ye righteous and elect, for glorious shall be your lot. And the righteous shall be in the light of the sun, and the elect in the light of eternal life. The days of their life shall be unending, and the days of the holy without number. And they shall seek the light, and find righteousness with the Lord of spirits. And there shall be peace to the righteous in the name of the eternal Lord. And after this it shall be said to the holy in heaven that they should seek out the secrets of righteousness, the heritage of faith. For it has become bright as the sun upon earth, and the darkness is past, and there shall be a light that never endeth. And to a limit of days they shall not come, for the darkness shall have been destroyed, and the light established before the Lord of Spirits and the light of uprightness established forever before the Lord of Spirits. In those days mine eyes saw the secrets of the lightnings, and of the lights, and the judgments they execute, and they lighten for a blessing or a curse, as the Lord of Spirits willeth. And there I saw the secrets of the thunder, and how when it resounds above in the heaven, the sound thereof is heard. And he caused me to see the judgments executed on the earth, whether they be for well-being and blessing, or for a curse, according to the word of the Lord of Spirits. And after that, all the secrets of the lights and lightnings were shown to me, and they lightened for a blessing and for satisfying. In the year 500, in the seventh month, on the fourteenth day of the month, in the life of Enoch. In that parable, I saw how a mighty quaking made the heaven of heavens to quake, and the host of the Most High, and the angels, a thousand thousands and ten thousand times ten thousand were disquieted with a great disquiet. And the head of day sat on the throne of his glory, and the angels and the righteous stood around him. And a great trembling seized me, and fear took hold of me, and my loins gave way, and dissolved were my reins, and I fell upon my face. And Michael sent another angel from among the holy ones, and he raised me up. And when he had raised me up, my spirit returned, for I had not been able to endure the look of this host, and the commotion, and the quaking of the heaven. And Michael said unto me, Why art thou disquieted with such a vision? Until this day lasted the day of his mercy, and he hath been merciful and long-suffering towards those who dwell on the earth. And when the day and the power, and the punishment, and the judgment come, which the Lord of spirits hath prepared for those who worship not the righteous law, and for those who deny the righteous judgment, and for those who take his name in vain, that day is prepared, for the elect a covenant, but for the sinners an inquisition. When the punishment of the Lord of Spirits shall rest upon them, it shall rest in order that the punishment of the Lord of Spirits may not come in vain, and it shall slay the children with their mothers and the children with their fathers. Afterwards, the judgment shall take place according to his mercy and his patience. And on that day were two monsters parted, a female monster named Leviathan, to dwell in the abysses of the ocean, over the fountains of the waters. But the male is named Behemoth, who occupied with his breast a waste wilderness named Dudain, on the east of the garden, where the elect and righteous dwell, where my grandfather was taken up, the seventh from Adam, the first man whom the Lord of Spirits created. And I besought the other angel that he should show me the might of those monsters, how they were parted on one day and cast the one into the abysses of the sea. You know, I'm going to stop right there and uh, talk a little bit, you know what I'm saying? This is my last day in this house, you know what I'm saying? 
And you know, I supposed to go stay with my daughter and them, you know what I'm saying? But I don't wanna go, you know what I'm saying? Man, I had my best days living in my truck without having that ex-wife to be lying on me and, you know, all, you know, treat me bad, you know what I'm saying? And then, you know, I had to fall off for a little bit more, you know what I'm saying? All I want is to get me a truck and eventually get me a house, you know what I'm saying? I got everything I need, you know what I'm saying? But then, you know, I don't wanna be with, you know, family members who don't love me, you know what I'm saying? Everybody wanna look forward to something, you know what I'm saying? I used to look forward to the first and the 15th. I know it was, to me, that's sad, you know what I'm saying? Because I was on disability, you know what I'm saying? For no reason, you know what I'm saying? Because my problem was just passing out. You know what I'm saying? It was just passing out. And I was scared that I'd be on a ladder at work and pass out and faint, you know what I'm saying? And then fall off the ladder, you know what I'm saying? That's what I was scared of, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, you know, you know, God bless me, you know, that didn't happen, you know what I'm saying? But that's the reason I filed for disability not for any other reason. And then eventually it got caught up to me, you know what I'm saying? I did faint at work. Fainted talking to Hank, you know what I'm saying? 2017, you know what I'm saying? I fainted talking to my coworker, you know what I'm saying? The safety man. Same dude that I screamed out, he ain't never been up here with us, you know what I'm saying? and blew his hair with just my voice, you know what I'm saying? And John came up to me and said, God, out of all the places in the world you could have came to, you had to come to the earth, you know what I'm saying? And then when I went silent, you know what I'm saying? Cause I got scared, you know what I'm saying? Cause I realized that, you know, now I know it sounds funny me saying that I'm God, but then, you know, when I realized God tapped in and overread Adam and spoke through me, you know what I'm saying? I knew I was God, you know what I'm saying? I knew I was God when I died at Dow Chemical. And then I took them five sleeping pills the doctor told me to take. And then when I did that, you know what I'm saying? Um, I wrote a letter from God, you know what I'm saying, to Dow Chemical, to the community, to the government. And you know, man, hey, I, I didn't know what I was doing right then. That was 98, you know what I'm saying? I was just, you know, trying to do what I was supposed to do and let the world know that, you know what I'm saying? That was the reason I took the pills, cause the doctor told me, you know what I'm saying? It was an accidental suicide. So it was an accidental suicide letter, but they didn't take it like that. You know what I'm saying? They lied, Dow Chemical lied, and said that uh, I was having problems with the job that I was, the new job that I had took, you know what I'm saying? But I didn't have problems at that job. I just knew Dow Chemical didn't, you know, ha wasn't meaning me no good, you know what I'm saying? Just like the after I did get fired for not coming back to work, telling them that go ahead and fire me, you know, cause they knew they owed me some money, you know what I'm saying? But then they didn't pay me, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I died, you know what I'm saying? And then I came back, you know what I'm saying? Right, like, like the Bible say, Jesus died and three days later he rose up. That's basically how I did, but I just rose up, you know, it was like three or four days later, you know what I'm saying? 
or whatever. They say it was longer than that, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I'm sorry about what I put the world through, you know what I'm saying? I'm sorry, you know, that I became God and started talking as God all them years, neglecting my kids, you know what I'm saying? They was pretty much grown, you know what I'm saying? They was grown, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, but that's that, you know what I'm saying? This is the first Adam, you know what I'm saying? And I, I, I know on that. I ain't gonna say if I ain't God, you know what I'm saying? Cause I know I am, you know what I'm saying? I am God, you know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna stick with that to the day I die, you know what I'm saying? That's 33 more years, that's what God say anyway, you know what I'm saying? I might die today, you know what I'm saying? But then I'm gonna live forever in the spirits of them kids and grandkids. They'll remember me, even though the kids did me wrong. They'll remember me, you know what I'm saying? They'll remember me, you know, man, I'm at my last draw, you know what I'm saying? Dow Chemical and paid everybody to sabotage me and ambush me and crucify me and persecute me, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, it was all for no reason, you know what I'm saying? Just because I say I'm God, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know, I, you know, looking at this YouTube, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to find stuff to listen to, you know what I'm saying? And then I watched the video of men finding out that their children were nails. Or finding out that their girlfriend or wife was cheating, you know what I'm saying? And I watched that video, you know what I'm saying, for a little while. And, and, and it just, you know, told me, you know, it's a whole lot of people out there that's got worse problems than I got. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people out there that's got worse problems than I got. You know what I'm saying? Some people did. Lost loved ones, uh, lost their life, you know what I'm saying? But then, you know, you know, I just can't see myself, you know, not looking forward to a paycheck, you know what I'm saying? So if I die, you know what I'm saying, it's because I was just giving away money and they just got tired of me and, you know what I'm saying, didn't want me no more, you know what I'm saying? That's just God's last, you know what I'm saying? Saying that's Adam God, you know what I'm saying? For anybody out there who wanna say anything, a miracle has happened, a mirror call. Cause Adam go to the mirror, he see God. And I see God, you know what I'm saying? This Uncle Peck, his grandfather, and this Uncle Richard, his uncle, you know what I'm saying? And we both passed. You know what I'm saying? But we in Adam, this LC, Uncle Pig, best friend. Shit, I died a long time ago before, you know, Pig. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, Adam has did a miracle. He brought God to life. You know what I'm saying? I remember the day he walked outside and the earth started breathing. You know what I'm saying? and the sun shined a little bit better. You know, all summer, we ain't had rain, but maybe six times, maybe 10, you know what I'm saying? All summer, if we had rain six or five, 10 times, because we ain't had rain, but I don't see, remember rain, but maybe three or four days, you know what I'm saying, of rain, you know what I'm saying? But this God, man, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, it's a lot of pressure on me now because I don't even know if they want me to go to the apartment with them, you know what I'm saying? I done threw away all my old clothes, you know what I'm saying? I need new ones, you know what I'm saying? 
I got a plan to get me a truck. You know what I'm saying? Because First State Bank, you know, they owe me a whole truck. They don't owe me just for a few payments. They owe me for a whole truck because I put the down payment on it. The only problem I, I had, I allowed that woman, that ex-wife, to co-sign for me. And she stole my truck, added to my payments, so I could keep paying, you know what I'm saying, on her stuff, you know what I'm saying, and never finish paying for that truck. You know what I'm saying? And I just wasn't going for it, and when I didn't go for it, she stole it. You know what I'm saying? And First State Bank let her do it, you know what I'm saying? So, you know me, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm just, you know, like I say, I got a plan. If I live long enough, you know what I'm saying? If I live long enough, let's go back to the book of Enoch, you know what I'm saying? Let's go back to the book of Enoch because I just need to know what's going to happen because this is the end right here. This is just like the end, you know what I'm saying? Because this God, this the God of the world, you know what I'm saying? And I don't know how long I'm going to continue saying I'm God, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how long I'm going to be able to continue saying I'm God. But that's the mirror call, call to the mirror to see yourself as God. Adam taught y'all that. And, you know, he know all the people that he used to work with know. You know, right now, they probably, a lot of them, you know, if they watching this, they in tears. You know what I'm saying? Because Adam was the best co-worker anybody could ever have this God. I know, because I was each one of them men that he worked with. You know what I'm saying? I was each one of them daughters and sons that he had. You know what I'm saying? I was, I was his grandmother. I was his grandfather. I was his aunt, I was his uncle, I was his sister, brother, and uncle. I was his deceased grandparents, you know what I'm saying? I was all that to Adam, you know what I'm saying? Adam, he should have been a trust fund baby, you know what I'm saying? But then, you know, they picked somebody else to be the first baby, you know what I'm saying? So he didn't get that, you know what I'm saying? But mama did kept his insurance. And that's what somebody is trying to use. And eventually, you know, they want a death certificate and then he get $5,000 or whatever they're going to get. You know what I'm saying? A dog might have even told him it's going to be more than that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you never know what people do for money. You know what I'm saying? What people do for money. You know what I'm saying? Come on, R.H., and I say R.H., that's Uncle Peck's initials, R.H. Jackson, but this R.H. Charles. And the other into the dry land of the wilderness. And he said to me, Thou son of man, herein thou dost seek to know what is hidden. And the other angel who went with me and showed me what was hidden told me what is first and last in heaven in the height and beneath the earth in the depth and at the ends of the heaven and on the foundation of the heaven and the chambers of the winds and how the winds are divided and how they are weighed and how the portals of the winds are reckoned each according to the power of the wind and the power of the lights of the moon and according to the power that is fitting and the divisions of the stars according to their names and how all the divisions are divided and the thunders according to the places you notice he said the stars are named according to their names each star according to their names you know what i'm saying each star has a name and you are the stars that has have those names you are the stars the people you know what I'm saying? You are the heavens. You know, the Bible say God was in the heavens. That's what Genesis 1-1 was. It's not that anymore, but it was. 
in the beginning it was God was in the heavens and you was the heavens God was in. God was in the heavens and the spirit of God was hovering over the waters and God said, let there be light. You know what I'm saying? And there was light. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, this the book of him. You know what I'm saying? And this me, you know what I'm saying, on my last 